That was good, actually. Hola, everyone. It's Cheryl from Cher Crochet, and it is snow apocalypse here in Michigan. I've taken the day off of my day job, and I'm going to make bread today uh, in the way of hamburger buns. I got this recipe from All Recipes. Uh, I'm going to put the link down below so you can just follow along that way. And um, uh, love the smell of bread baking in my house. Just makes everything smell warm and wonderful, especially with this snow all over the place. It's definitely going to be a good recipe for you guys. So uh, stick around. To start our hamburger buns, you are going to need a cup of warm water in your mixing bowl. Straight out of the tap is fine, nice and warm. You're gonna need to dissolve a package of instant dry yeast and add just a half a cup of flour into there and we mix that up. Till it's nice and dissolved. And you just want to let it sit till it gets nice and bubbly. And while you're waiting for the yeast to activate, go ahead and melt three tablespoons of unsalted butter. Okay, so now that my yeast has activated, I'm going to add a whisked egg. I'm going to add some salt. I'm going to add some white sugar. And some melted butter, about three tablespoons of that. And now we add our flour. This is bread flour. I'm gonna add about uh, three cups to start. Depending on the weather, Depends on how your dough is going to react. And it's freezing here, so we may need, we may not need as much. The more humid it is outside, the stickier the dough is gonna be, the more flour you're gonna need. So we're gonna start with this and see what happens. And that looks about right. Lightly flour your work surface. And we're going to get the dough ball out. Ah, there we go. It's perfect. You're going to just kind of knead it by hand a little bit. Not too much. And then we roll it into a ball. And we put it in a bowl that has a little bit of olive oil in it so it doesn't stick. Kind of get it all around the edges there. Okay, your dough needs to rest and rise until it's about double in size. When it's cold, like it is here in Michigan, what I like to do is get out old trusty heating pad, put it on low, put your dough right on top of that, Give it a, make it all snuggly and warm, cover it up. About one to two hours. Baking bread is definitely a commitment. It takes a long time to make one loaf of bread. But believe me, the flavor and texture of a fresh baked loaf of bread right out of your oven, you can't beat it with any of your prepackaged grocery store items. It's definitely worth the wait. Trust the process. It's been about an hour and a half, and our dough looks amazing. Nice. Ooh, it's warm. <laughs> so what we're going to do now is we're going to punch her down. Ooh, get some of those bubbles out. And we put it on our work surface. Just kind of punch it down, work it out. And we're going to cut this into eight equal portions. Got my handy pastry cutter here. All 
I've got eight roughly equal portions here. And we're just gonna roll them out into a nice little ball. Give them a nice smash. So they're flat-ish. And over here I have my baking sheet with a lined uh, parchment paper. And we're just gonna keep on rolling. rolling these babies and mushing them. Try and get them as flat as you can. They'll spring back a little bit, but that is okay. As long as they're kind of disc-like. Got my buns laid out on a cookie sheet lined with parchment paper and these need to rest and rise again. One hour, then we bake. Okay, our buns are ready for the oven. But first, we need to brush and glaze them with a beaten egg. We add one tablespoon of milk to that. Give that a whisk. And we get our brush. Gently coat the tops of all of these with your egg wash. Do you like sesame seeds? I love sesame seeds. You did preheat the oven to 375, right? In the oven we go. Wait until you see my buns. <laughs> wow. I have no idea why anybody would ever buy pre-made buns. These have to cool quite a bit before you can eat them, but you definitely, definitely need to give this recipe a try because I know my cheese, my bacon cheeseburger on these later today are going to be outstanding. All right. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like this video.